you get me coffee thank you so much that's so sweet all right love you bye my brother literally just called me to ask if i wanted coffee wow what is today oh there's me and him mm -hmm. oh my gosh thank you so much it is friday morning july 5th my fam and I just got back from Illinois last night on 4th of July. We got home just in time to watch some fireworks and hang out with our neighbors. We had like a little neighborhood party. It was really fun. But yeah, so today is Friday and tomorrow, July 6th, I head to New York City for two weeks for my internship with Wave. I'm so excited. It's been all summer. It's been remote. And then the last two weeks are in New York and we're going to be doing lots of meetings and projects and events. I'm actually going to be living with Margot Lee here on YouTube. Um, we're staying in an apartment together in the city. So I'm very excited. I only have a one day turnaround, so I'm soaking up all my time at home as I can. Obviously when I get back, I'll I still have time at home before I go to school. I thought it'd be fun to do a vlog today because I'm unpacking from this trip from last week, my family reunion, and now I'm packing for two weeks in New York City, which is going to be interesting. Like I'm debating on bringing two suitcases because I just want to have a ton of clothing, I don't know. And I also have a ton of work I'm doing. I'm recording with Brooke today for our podcast, Gals on the Go. If you guys don't know, we have a podcast, it's awesome. And I'm filming a couple of videos today. I have to get my nails done, there's just there's a lot to be done today and I just got some HelloFresh meals in the mail and we have nothing in our fridge since we've been on vacation so my mom and I I think are going to make some food later so that's kind of the layout for the day I'm wearing this Nantucket shirt my dad just went to Nantucket to visit some college friends and he got me this shirt and I'm honestly obsessed with it and I'm probably gonna wear it all the time so get ready to see this all the time and yeah enjoy this vlog <laughs> Guys, oh my gosh, I am having the best morning. I'm just feeling so good, so happy. I've got my coffee, it's definitely kicking in. I haven't had nitro in a while. I never do this, but I'm on Spotify's like top hits and there are some good songs out right now. So I'm making like a summer in New York City playlist on Spotify, you guys can check it out. It's gonna be the playlist that I listen to while I'm like commuting to work, who am I? Um, and I am heavily planning out today. Like we are getting pretty darn intense. I use a day designer for those of you guys who don't know. I always have a link down below, but Post Malone just came out with a new song called Goodbyes. It is so good like you guys need to listen to it like i think i'm gonna get tired of it but i'm just gonna listen to it until i get tired of it first off we're gonna do our makeup we're gonna get ready for the day then i'm gonna take some photos for instagram um for some brand sponsorships i'm doing then i'm gonna go get a manicure then i'm gonna come back i think make lunch aka hello fresh and then record my podcast with brooke and then probably eat again because hungry and then I have two videos to film and then also packing so we're gonna do a little pack with me um and that's just like tentative I'm gonna try and follow it as much as I can I'm probably gonna be up late tonight so it's gonna be a super fun long vlog but yeah hopefully this inspires you guys to get after it because this is going to be a very productive vlog okay let's go do my makeup all right, makeup is done. I am wearing this really fun yellow jumpsuit that I just got from Nasty Gal that I'll be doing. I'm filming a haul for it later, so you'll see it. Um, but I'm about to take a Instagram photo and Instagram photo, oh my gosh. I'm gonna sit on my desk and make it all cool and fun. Oh my gosh, these aren't even straight. Just to put into reference, what goes on behind the scenes. I l tried to make my desk look a lot cleaner than it actually is. I took a picture right there. It ended up being really cute. 
but yeah, now I have to like either put all this stuff back or maybe I'll actually, maybe I'll actually organize it this time. Just but. took Instagram photo at number two. I just love this shirt. It's so fun. Um, a little change of plans. I think I'm going to go get my nails done at the mall later because they stay open. The reason I was going to go now is because the nail salon just closes at like five or six, I think. But the one at the mall closes when the mall closes, which is nine. All right, guys, I am hungry. It is time to eat. I just want to make something super quick. So I'm going to do one of my 30-minute meals from HelloFresh. I've got all these three right here to choose from. I decided to go for the two-person veggie plan because I like seeing all the different recipes that they've got. As you guys know, I'm a big fan of HelloFresh. They just make it super easy to kind of, well, conquer the kitchen and make super delicious and simple recipes. You get everything in pre-measured ingredients, so it's super easy to follow this six-step recipe guide. Like I said earlier, there's three plans to choose from, so I got the veggie plan, but there's also classic and family. And it's just an easy way to get out of your recipe rut. So you guys know I love HelloFresh. I'll be using them in the fall with my roommate. We're so excited to cook together. Um, but it's even nice if you just want to make a quick lunch. So I think I'm going to go for this one. It looks so good. You guys know I love anything to do with pasta. This is the... This is from their Hall of Fame, and it's the creamiest mushroom ravioli. I'm just so excited. I've got all the ingredients in my fridge. I got my box the other day with all three different bags, with everything for each recipe. HelloFresh is also now from $6.99 per serving, which is awesome. And if you want to get started with eight free meals, that's $80 off your first month of HelloFresh. Go to HelloFresh.com and enter the code DanielleCarolyn80. So I was gonna wait for my mom, but I'm honestly just so hungry, so I'm gonna get a head start. She's gonna be so excited when she walks in. My family always gets really excited when I get HelloFresh at home because they just wanna make it too. So I already took out the mushroom ravioli, and then in the fridge I've got the rest for everything. I believe it is this one. Here's the rest of the ingredients for it. So yeah, we've got all the ingredients. I've got them all here, and now I'm honestly just gonna follow the recipe. I also love HelloFresh because you can add extra meals to your weekly order as well as yummy sides or desserts like garlic bread and cookie dough. Yum. <laughs> oh, look at this beauty. I'm just going to garnish with a little parsley. My mom is going to join me. She helped me. Oh my gosh, guys. This looks absolutely amazing oh we're like we're setting up yes. look at that so we like the candle <laughs> such a beautiful lunch to come home to i know coming home to food by me is not something that's a deal oh my gosh i'm so excited yeah. guys updates delicious i just went and got more from the pan i'm just wow currently charging up my portable charger because i feel like i'm going to be needing to use this a lot in the city just because you're a gal on the go there, and I might be gone all day, so I'm just charging this up so I can pack it. Um, yeah. All right, we've got Dynasty on. I'm about to tackle my suitcase from going to Illinois. We're going to unpack this because we can't pack if we don't unpack, right? <laughs> All right, done unpacking. Put some stuff aside already while I was unpacking slash from my closet that I definitely want to bring to New York. Getting all set up to record with Brooke. Got the mic ready, headphones plugged in, green tea steeped and drinking that water. About to Skype Brooke and we're gonna record this week's episode of Gals on the Go, baby. All right, we're gonna call Brookie. Hi. What is up you guys? Welcome back to Gals on the Go podcast. I am Danielle. We are so hyped to be here. Oh my gosh, it has been a couple weeks since we've both sat down and recorded together. Just finished recording Gals on the Go, submitted the episode to our producer. I'm now drinking so many, I'm drinking so many beverages today. Kombucha, it's been a minute since I had kombucha. This is my favorite gingerberry. Um, it kind of just like calms me down. I don't know why and I feel like it de me and just makes me feel good and get those probiotics in everything like that I just talked to Margo and she said she's bringing like a very small suitcase because she doesn't know how big her apartment's gonna be and this is true So I'm not gonna bring two suitcases. 
psycho I'm just gonna bring one so now i'm like trying to figure out i've got like some new clothes that i literally bought for my internship that i definitely want to bring and so then i have this huge pile that i'm going to go through because i kind of plan to do like a good bit of shopping when i'm there so i'm really trying not to bring a lot because i know i'm gonna bring be bringing a lot back i'm trying to figure that out right now and i have two more videos to film and i still need to get my nails done so I'm at a crossroads of what to do. Upon further review, I've decided to go get my nails done now. I just change into a little on-the-go outfit and then film and finish packing when I get back. So, Lego. So my nails are obviously shorter again and I just did a nice light pink in case I need to be able to be a little bit more professional. There were no rules about nail color, obviously. It's kind of a more chill uh, internship. But I really like this color. It's kind of like a muted neon pink in a way. It's just kind of like, I don't know. It's like low key. But my t my fingers are definitely like little nubs now. <laughs> Back home again. And I'm just going through some emails and planning out the next two videos I'm about to film tonight. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to film like real sit down videos once I get to New York. Because, well, for many reasons. But we're sharing an apartment. Um, we're doing like an Airbnb situation. And I'm pretty sure it's just like sliding doors. So like I don't really want to be filming there. Um, but we have like the wing and other places we can go for like workspace. But yeah, I'm feeling a little bit of FOMO right now. I don't usually get FOMO either. It's just like a weekend that everyone's in Athens right now. My college town. Um, like all my best friends, my boyfriend, they're all there right now for like this fun event. And that's the one thing about us out of state. Like you can't go back as much over the summer. And sometimes your friends will like randomly go back. So I'm like dealing with the FOMO a little bit. I never get FOMO. I don't know what's up with me, but I'm just trying to like keep busy. And I know tomorrow when I head to New York, I'm literally my happiest self when I'm there. Not my happiest self, but I'm definitely a thriving gal when I'm there. So I'm just really excited to be there. I'm texting with Margo right now. And like, we're pretty sure we just have like one little dresser and I'm trying to decide if there's like under the bed storage. So done with filming all my videos. I'm so excited. I'm gonna have videos going up while I'm in New York and I'm gonna be obviously posting videos in real time like vlogs and stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna do like week of my life or weekend of my life or days of my life. Who knows what I'm gonna do, but feeling good about that. That is all done. I don't have to edit those videos until I'm in New York or I'm on the plane. I just wanted to get those videos done and get them done here and I'm just so happy feeling good. It's definitely late. I think it's uh it's 10 o'clock on the dot. I was like, it's almost 10 o'clock. It is 10 o'clock. Now I've put a ton of stuff aside that I want to pack. I've decided I'm going to go for my medium sized luggage. There is a update, no under the bed storage for our apartment, but I still, I'm just going to need to bring some stuff, but I'm just going to go for less is more because I know I'm going to shop while I'm there. So let's pack for New York city. So I actually ended up bringing back up the suitcase. I'm out of breath. <laughs> that i brought to illinois because it's stretchy it's like random like kenneth cole reaction it's kind of cute though not that that matters it's just super functional and stretchy and has an extender if needed it's not huge but it's perfect and if i shop when i'm there i can just bring another duffel on the way back the goal is to not bring this super stuffed i need to be minimalistic gonna watch an episode of the bold type while i pack to get me inspired because it's about three gals working in New York City, so I think it'll get me excited. All right, so I've organized and pulled everything out by category so I can kind of see how much of everything I have, if everything's proportional, like what I'm missing, whatever. Here we've got all of my leggings, a pair of biker shorts, and a casual shirt and some joggers because I plan to do a lot of soul cycle while I'm there. So then I brought, I think, five or six sports bras. Over here I've got two bodysuits and a fun black tank. Or not fun, it's actually very simple. And then I just have some other fun tops and some like graphic tees, stuff like that. I have my nicer blouses right here. I have my skirts here. I just have three. I have four jumpsuit, play suit situations. These are all my pants. I have three like nicer trouser pairs and then two denim and then like another pair. Two pairs of shorts back there and then some dresses right here. So that's kind of how I organized it all. And then I'm gonna bring a pair of pajamas. So I'll just wear those every night. And I'm gonna bring a bathing suit because Margo said we might go to Greenwich for the day to like go boating. I'm not really sure. Basically, these are the basics. These are things that will get me through, I think, but I do plan to do some shopping. I plan to go to like Topshop or Soho. I think Margo and I are going to do that on Sunday, and I want to get a really cool blazer and just some other stuff. I just want to be prepared, you know, and yeah, so I'm going to see what this all looks like in my suitcase. I'm hoping 
it's not super stuffed because I just, uh, but this is like the bare minimum. Not actually the bare minimum, I'm being dramatic, but you guys know what I mean. Like, it's New York City, like gotta be fashionable, and I have to pack shoes, I'm trying to figure that all out. All right, everything is in, you know, there's still room if I needed to push. But yeah, these are the shoes I'm going to bring. I'm bringing these for just like walking around the apartment, going to spin, whatever it may be. I'm gonna wear these on the plane. These will be my like everyday sneakers. These will be another everyday shoe. They're super comfortable and they'll go with a lot. These would be an also an everyday shoe, and these are like if we go out to dinner, stuff like that. I'm gonna take off my makeup, it's been on all day, and I've been filming and retouching, and it's just gross. Do a face mask, you know, have a little self-care night, enjoy my last night alone in my room for 10 days. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it for you guys. It was a nice little, like, prep, I don't know, kind of video, but yeah. Love you guys so much, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys very soon for our next video. Bye-bye!